I think of Army football, I don't think of just the family that I have on the team, but I think of my father because he played on the same team. My goal here is to become a United States Marine. My goal is to serve my country with honor and become an astronaut. I'll be an armor officer, just like my grandfather before me. My goal is to serve this country and to make my family proud. Forged deep into the bedrock of each American generation, these two institutions were formed to train leaders of character. The success of their mission spanning the history of this land. United in the defense of their country, they stand apart in only one place. When you show up as a plebe, that's the first thing that you learn is beat Army. That's the game, like, you have to win. It's an Army-Navy game. I, it kind of goes without saying how much it means. Each year since 1890, the ultimate brotherhood becomes the ultimate rivalry, a symbol of teamwork, commitment, and valor. It stirs patriotism, and when called upon, serves to heal. The game represents so much more than just one team versus another. We play for those fighting in battle. We play for our brothers. It's a bond that you can't describe and you can't get anywhere else. It means everything to me. To the winner, the privilege of singing second. It's an honor that has eluded Army for 11 straight years, with last year's loss being the toughest of all. Nothing doing on this one. Mm. Each year it seems we get closer and closer, and eventually, you know, the dam has to give and we, we have to win this game. When we, when we do end this streak, um, it's gonna mean a whole lot. The moment is at hand once again. On this day, allies become adversaries. My goal is to beat Navy in everything we do. Go Navy, beat Army, beat Army. Go Army, beat Navy. Go Navy, beat Army, beat Navy. Do it not only for us, but for all those before us. For the 114th time, it's Army, Navy.